Peggy 18. Detroit is Quantic Dream's latest project. It takes place in the near future in the city of Detroit and it features the character of Kara that we introduced in this short video uh, back in 2011. We're incredibly excited to announce it here in our own country in Paris at uh, Paris Games Week. There are androids that look, uh, speak and move exactly like human beings. So they're, they're really in this society and they are used to do different tasks and different things. We didn't want to do sci-fi. We didn't want to invent any technology that doesn't exist in labs today. We wanted the world to look familiar to the player, so we really feel like, oh, I, I know this place, this is a real place, but at the same time be surprised at each corner. We developed this uh, short video uh, featuring this character of, of Kara, uh, I think back in 2011, and um, it was a very, very exciting piece for us. It was a, a very interesting journey working with Valerie Curry, this great actress. But it left me a little bit frustrated because I wanted to know what would happen to this character when she leaves the factory and what the world would be like and uh, what she would think of it. And uh, this is how Detroit started. Detroit is really a, a fascinating place. It's a great place for industry, but also for creative people, and for artists of all kinds. And we thought that, well, if one day um, an Android industry has to appear somewhere, it should be in Detroit. It would be a logical place in, in many, many ways. We went there and really explored the city inside out. And yes, we've seen the abandoned churches and the abandoned places, but at the same time we saw fantastic places we met fantastic people and we could really feel the energy that was there and that was very, very inspiring. Detroit is featuring a brand new 3D engine. Uh, we love to do <laughs> one engine per game, which is a little bit crazy, but the idea is of course to really uh, leverage the power of the console and um, really try to offer a visual experience and a gameplay experience uh, that will be hopefully much better than on the previous generation of consoles. And we, we tried to use the technology um, to uh, improve the graphics, but also to improve the emotion that the player will feel, having better facial animation, having better lighting, having larger environments with a lot of life and passes by and things happening wherever you look around. I think there are some common points with what we've done in the past. It's based on storytelling, it's based on emotion and the emotional involvement of the player and the experience. But I think that the game has its own voice and it's really a different experience from Beyond and from Heavy Rain in many, many ways. The entire game is really built around this idea that the player is the co-writer of the experience uh, and that he will tell his own story uh, through his actions. So we can have a, a very, very significant impact on the story and, and more than the story on the world itself. Our theme is really what does it mean to be human, uh, what does it mean to have emotions and, and this kind of things and uh, this is really what we want to talk about. PS4 for the players.